Room 2110, I knocked on the door at the penthouse suite Cause I needed more from you Oh, I wanted an explanation Red solo cups all over the floor And your friends passed out, sleeping in that bed You wanted us to hang out in I guess you threw yourself a party you chose not to invite me Yeah, you threw yourself a party But you wanted me for a good time You said Text me when you get here You made it so clear It'd be nothing for the not Clothes on the floor Only wanted me naked But you can't have your cake And eat it all the time All the time Whoa, oh, whoa, oh, whoa Whoa, oh, whoa, oh, whoa All right, hey guys, so I just re-uploaded my life update video. The original one had a little issue with the dimensions, so then I fixed it and re-uploaded it. Hi, uh, can I get someone to come pick up the trash? I, I think, okay, so we are going for the gable system. All right, hey guys, so I just finished my team meeting for my hackathon and I am still eating my bibimbap, but I have to say this bibimbap is like very disappointing. Um, first of all, it is quite bland, like there's not much flavor. And then also second, it didn't come with any side dishes because usually with bibimbap, it comes with like kimchi, the uh, garlic, I don't, is it garlic? The like sweet potato thing that's really good. Um, and like radishes maybe sometimes but yeah just like usually five or six side dishes and this time it came with none so that is a big disappointment and it wasn't like this was like super cheap or anything this was like $15 so it's you know definitely a regular price for bibimbap but it just came with so much less things and also just like such a bland flavor so I am very disappointed <laughs> All right, hey guys, hang on, hang on, I have to vlog, hang on. All right, can't laugh. Okay. There were footsteps coming down the hallway, but when I turned around, it wasn't you. I was looking at myself, I couldn't see my face. Good morning, guys. Right now, it is super early in the morning. It's like 6.30, but I am out of quarantine, and I am going to move out of my hotel today. I am not going to lie. I am probably going to miss this view. This view is quite nice. Love it. So for breakfast, I am just eating some leftovers that I had from yesterday because this portion is really big and I could not finish. But I actually got fried rice and chicken nuggets from Pearl Castle, which was the very first meal that I had in Vancouver. So yesterday, I just decided to get that to like kind of say goodbye to this hotel, I guess. Oh my gosh, guys, I don't know if you guys can see, but right there, that's a little bunny. I'm gonna try to zoom in as close as I can get. But yeah, there's just a little bunny on the curb. And I think... Oh, he's leaving. Oh my gosh, he's so small and cute. Down the river was true. Shadows telling me a question. If I ever lost you, what would I do? What would I do? Back soon. 
Guys, I just found some geese. And also, my eyeshadow looks super glittery in this lighting. And I just found a little bunny too. He is so cute, oh my goodness. Hey guys, so I just got back to my hotel for my walk and I also got a Starbucks double shot on ice. I haven't had this in such a long time, so I'm super excited about this. And I am going to start packing up because I have to check out of this hotel in less than three hours. Alright, so I have packed up everything and I am about to leave. I also actually just squeezed a video in here because the lighting in my hotel room is actually really good and I just wanted to film one last video in here. So yeah, that is why I have my tripod out, but I'm going to pack this up now. Alright, I just checked over everything and now I am officially leaving my hotel. Alright, hey guys, so I have moved in to my new place and the room was actually smaller than I thought it would be because I saw a picture of it and it looked bigger than I thought. But overall, it's still really good. I do like it. I did not unpack anything yet because I am actually going to the beach. Guys, I see the beach. It's right there. Guys, look at how beautiful that skyline looks. It looks really small on camera. I was born under the sun, so I'm so afraid of you. Made peace with all I've done, but that just wasn't enough. She's a lecture once or twice. Yes, I am ashamed of it. I try to keep my soul intact. What else could I have done? I wanna say, hey, oh, woman, and I'm cold. Oh, I wanna go home alone. I wanna go home alone. Hey, oh, calling on my own. Hey guys, so I got back from the beach and right now I am sitting in my new room and um, yeah, I'm really excited. I already met two of my roommates and one of my roommates also has a cat but that roommate is not home currently but I met the cat because she or he just creeped into my room and I was like, oh, hi there. <laughs> okay, so I just got some sushi but this is like very, very average. So I don't really like it that much. She's a lecture once or twice. Yes, I am ashamed of it. I try to keep my soul intact. What else could I have done? All right, hey guys. So it has been a while since the last time that I vlogged. 
during this time I took a nap because I was like so tired so I think I napped for like two hours and then I did my laundry well then I took a shower and then did my laundry and then I set up my room so let me give you guys like a quick one over of what my room looks like right now all right so first we got the closet I put all my clothes in there and then I have um, this shelf that I just put some random stuff and then my two suitcases which are now empty this chair my backpack my desk and then I also just put some stuff in these drawers as well and then over here this is my bed I just took a nap so it's not made and then beside my bed I have a little like nightstand and I just put my light my water boiler because there's literally nowhere else to put it and then my water bottle so yeah this is my room it is a good size I would say it's like about the same size as my dorm last year so like I am used to living in a kind of small space but yeah um now i think i am going to eat my dinner and then get working because i can't slack off anymore i just have too much work to do hello guys so right now i am editing this vlog that you're watching and this next clip that you're about to see is a little bit dramatic actually it is quite dramatic but um i still wanted to leave it in because i want this vlog to be very real and authentic and i want you guys to see like my real emotions from that day because like i was quite stressed at that time and i was feeling quite overwhelmed but um i just don't want any of you watching to worry about me like i am completely completely fine now i have been living in this place that i moved into for almost a month now close to a month and yeah like it's fine there are no problems so um just know that i am okay but this next clip that you're about to watch is very dramatic <laughs> hi guys um so right now it's like 1 a.m and i'm lying in bed i just like really miss home like i just realized that living with roommates is going to be quite hard like i've never lived with any roommates before and now i'm living with three other people that like i don't know and i know like i do have my own room but the walls are really thin and like I can just like hear a lot of noises especially when people walk around it's quite loud and like when people talk I can hear it too so I don't know and I'm pretty sensitive to noise and overall I just like I just I just don't know like I kind of don't know how how I'm gonna live here for like more than four months and that's just making me very overwhelmed and stressed and I don't know I just I just hope that I'll be able to have a good time and I'll be able to have a good experience but I, I don't know what to do <laughs> 